At 11-11 on the morning of November 11th in the year 1918, combatants in World War I laid down their arms. It was called Armistice Day, and it marked the end of the deadliest, bloodiest, most horrible war humanity had endured. The anniversary was marked for years. In 1954, the name was changed to Veterans Day as we know it to reflect soldiers who fought in all wars. Today, the Herald Andrews Post of the American Legion hosted a parade for veterans in the city of Portland, the first one since the pandemic. New Center Maine's Ann Baldridge and photojournalist Jake Richards were there. Oh, we come every year to honor the veterans and the flag. Well, I'm pleased and honored that they took the time to come out and to uh, thank us kindly for our uh, sacrifices that were made and for the contributions that we made along the way. It's really great to see everybody coming out. It's a great day to you know, remember our veterans, so it's nice to see everyone out and the kids. So my twin sister is actually in ROTC. She's in the enlisted into the Army National Guard. So she's in the parade and she's carrying one of the flags with the USM crowd. And my grandfather is actually a US Army veteran, so it's a very important day to be here and support them. This flag here represents my husband's time in the service, World War II. He was in the Navy. And this is the flag that unfortunately covered his casket but uh, we come every year to honor him and the flag and the city of portland i grew up in the city of portland well it's one day out of the year i think every day you should be thanking a veteran but uh, it's one day to honor them and let them know that we do support them and we appreciate what they've done we all thank you for your service. The parade was followed with a wreath-laying ceremony as well as speeches at City Hall.